Smart glasses have been the next big thing for over a decade, and yet they've never quite lived up to the hype. But a small startup, Brilliant Labs, thinks it has cracked the code with a pair of AI-powered glasses called Halo. At first glance, Halo looks like an ordinary pair of Wayfarer-style specs, but inside that 40-gram frame, a camera, a microphone, bone conduction speakers, even a color OLED display. And somehow, the battery lasts up to 14 hours. But here's the twist. Halo doesn't overlay images onto the lenses. Instead, it projects into your peripheral vision. Slim design? Yes. But some might find it less immersive than pricier models with prism-based displays. Hardware aside, Halo's real trick is its AI companion, Noah. Think of it more than just an assistant. It sees what you see, hears what you hear, and responds like you're having a natural conversation. But Noah isn't just answering questions. It's paired with something called narrative, a memory system that can recall names, faces, and even conversations from years, even decades later. Imagine glasses that remember your life. Of course, that raises the big question. Privacy. Brilliant promises encrypted interactions, voice commands to turn off the mic or camera, and full control over what's stored. But let's be honest. If something's watching and listening all day, some people just won't be comfortable. Still, Halo's ambitions go further. Brilliant claims you can literally build apps by talking to your glasses. Just say what you need, and Noah supposedly creates an app for it in seconds. Pre-orders for Halo are live now, $299 a pair, with shipping set for November 2025. Brilliant Lab says supply is limited, so if this vision of wearable AI has you intrigued, you might want to move fast. Halo isn't just a gadget. It's a glimpse of what happens when AI moves from your pocket to your face. If you want to grab one for yourself, just tap the product link right here. It's the easiest way to check the latest price, and it helps support the channel too. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side.